Good morning, good afternoon, good night, you guys. Look at this beautiful views of Greece in the distance. What's up, guys? Lost Lion here again. We are off the coast of Corfu. It's a small island really near the border of Greece and Albania. So I just woke up, just got ready. Uh, we're gonna go eat, but first I wanna check out the other side of the ship because we're gonna be able to see Albania from that side. Just looking at a country from a distance is pretty cool. I'm not gonna step foot in Albania, so it doesn't count in my list, but uh, maybe one day go to Albania. Anyways, let's, uh, let's discuss what we got for the rest of the day. Okay, so we actually have a car rental which is gonna be 80 euros for the whole day really eight hours about and we're gonna drive around Corfu hit a few famous spots a few beautiful yeah. spots and then uh, drive around and go back to the old town and then walk around there we turn our car and come back to the ship so today's Corfu day uh, Greece and uh, then tomorrow is sea day so we have nothing to do tomorrow and then the next day is disembarkation day, which means we are leaving the ship. So this trip is almost over, but it has been quite the experience. Well, there you have it guys, right there is Corfu, old town right here. And then Albania is in the distance right over there. It is cool to say that Albania is right there. We can see it in the distance anyways. We're gonna have some breakfast and we gotta get off the ship real quick so we can start driving around Corfu. Beautiful day here. I'll give you guys all the details in a bit. We have the very tasty French toast burger. So good guys. Please get this at the galley for breakfast. Comes with some syrup it looks like. Some tater tots. And we have some pastries here. With the beautiful view of Albania. All right guys, a resilient lady is behind me and we are in our last stop here in Corfu, Greece. Can't wait, we just touched down here. We're gonna get a car, drive around, explore some locations on the west side of the island and then we'll go into Old Town at the very end. So, look at our beautiful ship and follow me. Reverse. Uh -huh. Drive. Drive. Finish. Easy. Easy. Full of petrol. Okay. Got it. So you bring it by a full. Uh -huh. So that's all. From here you drive north. Six o'clock here. If you change your mind, give me a ring. Okay. Something wrong mentally with him, I'm telling you. Donald Trump is mentally <laughs> messed up. So. I believe the best president in the United States was Barack. Oh, Barack Obama. Yeah. Yeah. And I like the first lady. Oh. Obama. Yeah. She's very, Anyways, you heard it here. She's, she's very, very popular in Europe, Michelle. Very she popular. Yeah. Alright guys, we got a rental car for 60 euros and that's 10 euros of it is insurance. Automatic car. Uh, cute little red car, so we'll show you more footage on that. Uh, we're ready to explore Kofu. Let's go. Alright guys, here we are at Kofu. Driving here for the very first time, I am excited. We got a 52 minute drive to the Love Canal of Greece. Got my GPS going. It's a beautiful day in Corfu. Anybody know this name, this brand? Just let me know, put it in the comments if you know. Ten minutes away guys, we're in the very north tip of Corfu and we're gonna go swim for a little bit. Can't wait to show you guys where we're going specifically. I'll let you guys know. Alright guys, here's our little red car. Cute little thing. Does the job. This was 60 euros like I mentioned and 10 of those euros were for the insurance. Okay, so now let me explain where we're going. Okay, so this is where we are, guys. Canal de Amor Beach. So supposedly, if you swim right there with your partner, 
you will have good luck in marriage for the rest of your life. So let's see if that's true. Canal de Amor. Corfu is beautiful, you guys. No filters needed. Oh my gosh, don't you just want to jump in that water? Yeah, Gonna get it inside in a bit. We're on the very north tip of Corfu. It's so cold. I can only stay there for a couple of minutes. It's really cold today. Oh, but it's gorgeous, isn't it? Okay, the Canal of Love, you guys, is over here to your left. Um, it is free. There's no entrance fee. There's no. Um, there's nobody over there checking anything. It's literally a, a little canal where you just go over there in the rocks and you can put your stuff and then you can lay out where you can go swim. And uh, it's right next to this resort. I don't know the name of it. I do see it like a hotel resort and the distance is about three levels. It's got a beautiful pool, a uh, bar, it's got lounge, lots of lounges. I'm not sure if you can have access to that. You probably gotta pay for access per day or so. But um, yeah, it's here, it's free. So no worries, parking is like a, not even a five minute walk up and down a little hill. And that's also free, there was nobody checking on, on, the, on the vehicles or anything. Um, you only need like 10 minutes here, not much, 20 minutes at most, so. All right guys, next point of view or stop that we, that we came to is 10 minutes from the uh, Love Canal. It's called Cape Drastis and it is to your right. Look how beautiful this is. Okay, guys, don't forget, once you see this sign, Cape Drastis, you're going to want to walk down there for a couple of minutes and you will see, you will see the, uh, the beautiful location that I just showed. So, it's worth it. It's fun. Come out. If you're driving around Corfu, you should. Alright guys, so now we have parked 5 euros to park here at Porto Timoni Beach. Now we're going to go to the viewpoint, which is going to look like this. From my research, this is the most beautiful beach in all of Corfu. So, let's start our little journey, 13 minute walk from here. It's gorgeous. Doesn't even feel real guys. It's gorgeous. Gorgeous views. We got a little bit of a, more of a hike to go. Porton Timoni Beach. All right guys, we have almost completed the hike and it's about 35 minutes to 40 minutes coming back up if you really don't stop. So just keep it in mind, at the beach that I mentioned earlier, it's worth it, guys. It's a little difficult. Make sure you have your hiking shoes and uh, it's like, again, worth it. Best beach in Corfu, according to lots of articles that I read, so drink some water and we're gonna head back to Corfu Old Town. Okay well the trip has come into the end here in Corfu today. Um, we're just kind of strolling around in the city. 
looking for parking. Hopefully we can visit this church to our right. Don't think we're gonna be able to stop guys here in Corfu downtown. There's just way too many cars. Not a single parking spot available. But just to give you guys an idea, it's a very, very old town. All right, see you later. That's our rental right there. 60 euros for one day. Avanti rental car. They came in clutch. They saved us because they had an automatic car. So it was worth it. And the gentleman was so nice. He dropped us off here at the cruise terminal so that we don't have to walk as much. And here we come again. Home sweet home, resilient lady. Oh man, we got something special tonight too. Cannot wait. A razzle dazzle kind of night. Let's have dinner. All right, here are the drinks for razzle dazzle. They have some good options here. And again, drinks do cost money, and you see the prices there. They got your beers, your more beer, not bad. They got your wines, whites, pink, and red. Now for food, they got your starters. And again, this is included. We got pork belly, that's probably what we're gonna get. Here are the mains. More of a vegetarian, vegan uh, restaurant, but they have uh, meat options as well. That sounds really, really good. You can do that if you want to be fancy. Okay, we're here for dinner at the beautiful Razzle Dazzle. As you can see, I love the red colors. It gives an effect to the whole restaurant and the vibe of the restaurant. This is awesome for dinner. It's our first time having it for dinner on this ship. And uh, we just ordered some delicious food, so can't wait to show you guys. My drink is called a Pop of Attraction. And so I was thinking, okay, she gives a uh, bucket of popcorn just to be fun, you know. But it ends up, she gave me this straw, and I'm like, I look in it, and I see a glass with the drink in there. So that's cool. You have to eat the popcorn before you get to the drink. That's badass. That's an alcoholic drink, $14. So. Chicken wings and... That's like a little salmon bite. No, tuna. Tuna, tuna, sorry guys. That's pork belly, by the way. We have the pastrami here with some bread and some sauce on the bottom. That looks delicious. And then we have the fried chicken with the chili sauce, it looks like. And a biscuit. Brazza Dazzle right here. I'm gonna give it a four out of five. Amazing food, uh, great drinks. It's, it's better than most restaurants here. Uh, it's probably my top three, top three here, so. I'll leave you guys with that, and we're gonna go have some fun. There's only one beer left. Rappers screaming all in our ears like we're deaf. I am a little sad guys. Man, we're back. 